My name is Christy and I am a speech teacher. Uh, the science word for that is speech language pathologist. So I work with kids every single day, well almost every single day, in the schools. And um, I like to tell kids that I specialize from here to here. So if you're having trouble understanding something or being able to talk clearly, or if you're missing some words, it's my job to teach you those things. And I stumbled upon this book. So I thought that I would get on here and read this book to you kids so that you would have a way of understanding this guy, coronavirus. Let's get started. Okay, the book says, hello, I am a virus. I'm cousins with the flu and the common cold. And my name is coronavirus. I love to travel. Look at this virus. He's got a suitcase and he is ready to party. And I like to jump from hand to hand. So here he is. Someone's given a high five and coronavirus is just hooked right on there. Have you ever heard about me? Yes or no? And how do you feel when you hear my name? You might feel relaxed. It might not bother you at all. You might feel a little bit confused because you hear a lot of adults talking about COVID or coronavirus all the time. You might feel worried about it. You might just feel curious, nervous, or sad. I can understand that you might feel grossed out. It's kind of how I feel sometimes. I would feel the same way. Sometimes adults get a little bit worried when they read the news and see me on TV. Look at that, he's like a rock star, this coronavirus. He's eating his popcorn and he says, hey, that's me on TV. You know one thing that you could do? Sometimes parents listen to their kids. So you could say to your mom or dad, mom, dad, get off your phone. Let's go for a walk or play a game. Those are some things that you are allowed to do right now. You could help your parents. But I'm going to explain myself, says coronavirus. Now he's got his glasses on. He's ready to teach you some stuff so that you can understand a little bit more about coronavirus or COVID. That's the same thing. This is the science name for corona, coronavirus, COVID-19. So when I come to visit, I bring a few things in my suitcase all attached to this blankie. Maybe some difficulty breathing. Have you ever had a really bad cold where it was hard to breathe? You might have a cough or even a fever. This is the important thing. I don't stay with people for very long and almost everyone gets better. So even though there's a lot of fear out there and people are very afraid, I want you to know that almost everybody gets better. So just like when you get a scrape on your knee, your lungs can heal. And then we say, bye coronavirus, and takes his suitcase and goes away. You don't really need to worry kids because the adults who take care of you in your house will keep you safe. That is their job. And you can help. So number one, it's telling you here that you could wash your hands with soap and water and you could sing a song like A, B, C, D, E, F, G, and then you will know that your hands are clean. You could also use some hand sanitizer and make sure you let it dry. So I brought some hand sanitizer right here. You squirt it on your hands spread it all around, but then you have to air dry. That's the most important step. You have to let it dry on your hands in order for it to work. And once your hands are dry, you can get back to playing again. And if you do all those things, I will not come to visit. You can get rid of this guy. So while the doctors work to find a vaccine that will allow me to say hi without getting you sick, we all need to stay calm is what we need to do. And I've heard they're working really hard on that vaccine. That is the end of the coronavirus or COVID book. So the woman who made this book is called Manuela Molina Cruz. And I think she might be from Colombia in South America. Now I'm going to attach some things in the comments. This is from the big life journal. So this is, if you're feeling really worried, and you're feeling really uncomfortable, here's some stuff that you could do at home with your family. There's apps you can download, there's books you can read, there's all sorts of things you can do.
Hope you like my story. Bye.